Hello everybody, this is Domo Supernaut here. Now, today I'm going to show you guys again how to play your Steam games when your friend is currently online. So anyway, this is after a couple of tries. I figured out another way how to do it. Just a heads up, this does not work with uh, with playing multiplayer. It sometimes works with LAN, but not with multiplayer. Gage mod is a little tricky to do. Someone posted a comment on how to do it with Gage mod. It's a little tricky to do. You gotta basically trick the system. But anyway, you gotta n network crap. Go to change adapter settings. I'm pretty sure you guys could just rewatch that part. And you guys have to have your internet enabled. Alright. Anyway, the first time I did it, um, it, it was like when I first booted up my computer. So it was a bit easier to do. So anyway, you you go put in your password, put in whatever capture you have, and you just put in your captcha for, for login info. <coughs> My drill hurts. Sorry about that. Hit OK, but as soon as you hit OK, you guys gotta click disable. All right. As soon as you hit OK, why the fuck did I click on park? Whoops. Sorry. Sorry about that. Alright, anyway, hit OK, click it, hit disable, and this is what you're gonna get. It'll either say play or buy. For me, it says play, and that's good. But if it says buy, I'll show you guys an example of that right now. Just let me go ahead and prove to you guys that this actually did work. Uh, just boot up Outlast. It's gonna. Say preparing to launch file. It takes a while for it to launch because like it's trying to get send info to Steam. Like, hey, this guy's playing a shared game. Yo, but since I have my internet disabled, it won't. It's thinking. It's thinking, and it can't bypass it. And it'll say, oh, uh, something about your Steam settings and all that. And just hit. I just went ahead and hit cancel. You go ahead and hit play. And it will perfectly work. So I'm gonna go ahead and enable my internet and go ahead and show you guys that I can't really do anything it tricks the system so it won't let you go back online it's a little tricky so yeah you guys gotta exit steam I'm just showing that to you guys again no matter how much you try yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and exit now sorry yeah, I got distracted <clears throat> So I'll go to Steam again, again, boot it up with my internet enabled, and this one should be the one where I didn't do it correctly, sorry about that, I got my wrong, I, got, I, did a, I, put, it, I put my wrong password in, and I go ahead and put in the capture I get, just, this you either get on your email or on your phone, it's usually on your phone, so anyway, uh, as you guys can, well, you guys have to go to settings. I'm sorry I didn't explain this before. You go to settings, go to make sure your Steam Guard is on. Go to family, and you guys have to deauthorize this computer. Your computer might be authorized. You gotta deauthorize it, so you get that captcha in the beginning, because it just makes it so much easier to do. And as you guys can tell, my friend is actually online. I, I'm not just bullshitting you guys. Because like last time you guys were saying that it was fake, blah blah blah. So anyway, uh, you go back into Steam, right? But since Steam has just updated everything, it's just a bit difficult to get it right. So what you gotta do is put in your password, put in got my password wrong again. God damn it! Uh, put in your password. Fuck. Put in your password. Uh. There we go, put in the captcha that you get, in my case it's this, doesn't really matter, it's a different captcha every time, hit OK, disable your internet, but since it should say that you should buy it this time, as you guys can see it says buy, you gotta buy it, and you don't want that, so you gotta exit out of Steam again, and it should say finishing Steam Sync, Steam Cloud Sync, that's what you want. Finish Steam Cloud Sync. So you go ahead and enable your internet. Go to Steam. Cause like if you do it once you're online, I did not explain that the first time. If you do it once you're online, 
it'll, it'll still have the, everything from last time. So, you put in your password again. I am so sorry if I get this wrong. Come on. Don't tell me I got it wrong. Ah, 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 fuck! All right, I got it wrong again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got it never. Oh my god. I'm just gonna type it a bit slower. Boom. Yep, I got it right. Alright, so you guys gotta put in your capture and it, as soon as you hit OK, you guys gotta click on disable. Alright, I'm gonna bring the the network and everything closer. Okay, disable. Boom. And there you go, that's how you do it. It's not very difficult. I hope you guys like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe. Remember it doesn't work with online games as well. Counter-Strike Go won't work, trust me on that. You need to buy that game. See you guys next time. Peace.